Seth Davis for Campus Insiders here at the NBA pre-draft combine in Chicago with former Arizona guard Nick Johnson. I don't know if it sounds weird to describe <laughs> you as a former Arizona guard, but uh, we just watched you out there on the floor. What did it feel like to get out and play ball again with people looking and analyzing you and uh, trying to pick apart your game again? <laughs> it was great. Uh, you know, a long, long lead up. Uh, seems like forever ago the, the season ended, so it was good to get back out here. Uh, I said this before, it's great to reconnect with all, all these guys that I, I've seen throughout college, throughout high school. Uh, some of them I haven't seen in a while, but it's, it, it's great to, to showcase our talents. Are, are you a big mock draft guy? Do you sort of have a feeling right now for where you're projected to go? Um, you know, I, I'm not really a big, big guy uh, in, in looking at those. You know, I, I just uh, kind of have always had, really had tunnel vision, um, you know. I know when I get in my workouts, I do what I need to do, and, and I'll be all right. So uh, as of right now, I haven't had any workouts. I'm going to wait till after after the combine, but uh, I'll be fine. Is there a certain part of your game that you've been working on the hardest since the college season ended? Yeah, just uh, you know, sharing up my, my jump shot. Um, you know, getting it to, to where people respect me, taking the, the shot, uh, making that transi transition from college to NBA range. Um, and then uh, just being more consistent or more comfortable with the ball in my hands. Uh, a lot of a lot of questions is uh, what position am I? You know, I'm a six three, shooting guard, point guard. What am I? Um, so I'm, I'm trying to answer those questions. Um, I, I believe I'm a point guard. I, I believe that I, I can make that transition uh, from from shooting guard to point guard in the NBA. And I, I believe there's a a lot of people that have done it in the past, and uh, I'm, I'm just you know trying to share my ball handling a little bit and, and show teams I can do that in my workouts. Looking back on on the season, how much have you replayed in your mind the Wisconsin game? I mean, is that the kind of a game? Do you watch the game? Have you watched the game, or do you try to put it behind you? How long did it take you to get to get over it? Um, I, I'm I'm really really not over it yet. Uh, it's it's definitely tough. I, I've seen the play uh, one time. Other than that, I was on the plane actually, and some guy uh, showed me. I, I was kind of mad at him because I didn't know what I was looking at, but. Uh, Seen it one time, and I mean, it, it's uh, it is what it is. I uh, wish I could have had that back, and, and and maybe done done something differently, give my my team a chance to win. But uh, I mean, you know, we're, we're uh, both uh, going in, in 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 the right way, and gonna have bright futures. You had a great season and a great college career. I congratulate you on that, Nick, and uh, best of luck with the draft and with what's ahead. Yeah, thank you, thank you so much.